Good morning, you guys. So, happy Sunday. Um, right now, I am heating up some coffee. And I'm about to get ready because I'm going to like a wine tasting uh, with the couples that are going to Paris with us. So, we're getting ready for that. And um, I don't know what I want to wear. It's like 67 degrees outside, which I want to take full advantage. Um, thinking about wearing my Bottega like fishnet heels or either the balenciaga mules not sure because i don't know if we're going to be like walking around viewing the place or just sitting there wine tasting so um yeah i kind of want to be prepared um and i don't want to wear just all black y'all know how i do so i'm thinking about wearing my green shirt that i recently hauled from zara i love that shirt the color is just so beautiful um but if i don't I don't know, I may wear like a sweater or something so I don't have to wear a jacket. Um, but yeah, that's what we're doing today. Come on, coffee, I need ya. I've already posted Sunday Style Inspo. And, ooh, it's hot. Yeah, I've already posted Sunday Style Inspo, so good to go on that. But yeah, let me go ahead and get this coffee ready. I think I have like an hour um, to get ready. And then I'll talk to y'all. Maybe when I get there, I'm not sure like how it's gonna go. Um, but if I can show y'all, then I will talk to y'all when I get to the winery. Talk to y'all later. So we're here late, of course. <laughs> and I can't even show y'all what I'm wearing because I don't have time, but just a jean jacket, black, and then I have on my Balenciaga mules. Um, so we're about to head in. I don't even know where this place is, but we are in the vicinity. Like wine number five, six, um, seven, 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 regardless. <laughs> my pits are sweating. Okay, regardless. My pits are sweating, and uh, I'm feeling good. But these, this, we have a little charcuterie here, and our wines. I'm having a good time. This, I know that we're gonna have a good time in Paris. Yeah. We, oh yeah, we're gonna have a great time. We're already time. laughing and joking. So ready. And we all mesh well, which is good. Yes, and this is K. Y'all remember K? Yeah, there's been more people too. Oh, okay. I thought you were bringing it. You always got your beer. Yeah. We're at Hampton Social. break right now um, I didn't get a chance to vlog this morning y'all I woke up kind of late because of this whole thing what did I bark? this whole time going back thing so yeah and I'm super busy today at work so really been working 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 but now I'm headed to the post office because I need to um drop off a few packages because I had like a mini little Instagram sale. I'll probably be posting more things come this Wednesday. Um, but of course you guys won't know that until the vlog is uploaded next Tuesday. So, <laughs> but yeah, y'all. So that's where I'm headed and also gonna get something to eat as well. Oh y'all, I am finally off of work. <laughs> Darn, I just got, it's just, it's hectic in here, but I am about to edit the vlog. It's so weird because I haven't edited the vlog in so long. So yeah, I'm about to edit the vlog. We'll see what this footage is looking like because girl, I kept forgetting to pick up that camera. So hopefully I'll do better this week, but I really don't have anything planned this week except maybe a facial on Saturday. So we'll see. Um, yeah so that's what i'm gonna do i'm also taking this wig off today i like the bob but i need to wash my hair and i've had this for like two weeks i think maybe a little longer which is very long for me so yeah it's about that time um 
I don't know what I'm going to do next, you know, but we'll figure it out. Um, daylight saving or whatever it's called, child, listen, I am pooped. I'm wiped. <laughs> I think I may make me some chicken, actually. Let me take some out. I went to the grocery store yesterday, which I didn't film that because um, we were so tired after like wine tasting and all of that jazz. Yeah, we were so tired, y'all. So we just came, chill, watch a little TV. And that was the end of that. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and um, let this thaw and edit. And I may use the air fryer because I probably don't feel like standing over the stove. So yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. I still even got my purse on my shoulder, y'all. That's how. Um, yes, that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> so anyway, y'all, I don't know if this is the end of the vlog for today, but if it is, thank you guys for tuning in to Monday. Oh, I did want to show y'all something. I got PR real okay, quick. Okay, so Pixie Beauty sent me this. I am on their list. So they sent me like this little hydrating milky collection. How cute is this? It's like a little milk cart. It's so cute. And then this is the hydrating milky makeup remover. We have the hydrating milky cleanser. And then we have the hydrating milky peel which exfoliates and smooths i'm excited about that i don't know how these will work with my skin but they sound cool milky tonic balance and comfort i get yeah this is toning then um you have the hydrating milky serum and then you have the hydrating milky lotion so this is a six step process as you can see makeup remover cleanse peel tone treat and moisturize so i thought this was so cute but i don't know i have to open them up i don't feel like it right now because i need to um get to work but so cute when i open it i'll show y'all okay y'all so here is my chicken seasoned i just use like mrs dash accent salt season all garlic powder you know the use I'm gonna use my air fryer, so we're gonna see. I'm still using uh, the directions because your girl don't know, okay? So it says, they asked me to put a little oil on there. So what I, I um, I'm gonna use, so it says to use a little oil. So I'm just gonna spray some Pam. I don't really wanna use too much oil. And then set the temperature to 390, which I did let it um, preheat and then set it for 20 minutes so that's what i'm gonna do so the wings are in there push it in i was gonna use this thing but i guess i don't need it and then i'm going to wait air fry can i put it on both no does it ever okay so i'll put it on air fry it's on 390 and then 20 minutes and start there we go so in 10 minutes i'll be flipping the wings now i gotta wash my hands before we catch salmonella <laughs> so this is what they are looking like 10 minutes in looking pretty good i'm gonna flip them over and put them back in but i think i'm gonna put mine in a little bit longer because yeah it's a little light but yeah so this is the finished product. They came out really good and crispy. So I'm excited. I think I'm gonna put some of this sauce on my Parmesan garlic wing sauce. Let's see how it tastes, but yes. But y'all, so um, if that is it probably for tonight, I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. And if I don't, oh, I may come back when I do my hair if I ever get to it, we'll see. Cause it's already late i worked super late today i think yeah it's 7 30. okay i work late so um yeah i'll see y'all later good morning you guys as you can see i did my hair last night um i need to get my lunch out i made as y'all saw i'm about to get my lunch out because i made chicken last night so I 
I'll probably pick up some vegetables or something at Publix to eat with it. Should I wear an earring? Probably should. Uh, my outfit is like doing a lot, yet not enough at the same time today, honey. Let me see how these earrings are gonna look. <laughs> so it is monday happy monday no it's not hey y'all so happy tuesday i'm gonna show you guys my outfit really quick not loving it but don't feel like changing again you can see i did my hair last night um i just i'm into really easy hairstyles so i don't want to do no curling or none of that um so i have on my lv earrings again i'm trying to get my wear out of these <laughs> and then i have on this bright lime kind of neon sweater I wish it was lime green, like that top. Um, and then I also have on these Free People pants. These are packages I got to send back. Free People pants. And I have on these old Zara shoes. Do y'all remember these? Yo, these were probably from like 2012, y'all. And then I'm carrying just my Alma BB. And yeah, headed out the door. So I'll talk to y'all a little bit later. <laughs> Honestly, today is one of those days I don't want to film, but I also don't want to put makeup on tomorrow, so I'll be filming <laughs> later on. <laughs> I'll see y'all later. Y'all, please tell me why I fell asleep. Look how oily my face is. I fell asleep, makeup and all. I did not film, so <laughs> I'm so tired, but I must stick with the schedule because if I don't, it won't get done at all. You know what I'm saying? That's why I put myself on this schedule because I'm the type of person that's like, look, I ain't got to do it. And then next thing you know, you don't have your content. So I know a lot of people may say, well, you don't have to worry about it. But for me, if I say I'm going to do something, I'm going to do it, which is why I put myself on the schedule to keep myself accountable. That's just how I am because naturally I'm, a la I'm lazy, lazy Libras, you know, sometimes. So you don't want to always do all the things, but, you know, you signed up for all the things. <laughs> so, yeah, I got to... um get my rack together filming my spring trends video so i am going to get myself together get my rack together get my mental together i already have wine chilling so that i have something to look forward to when i get done and then yeah so i'm gonna get this done i'm telling y'all while i'm also motivating myself <laughs> So if you need the motivation, I hope this motivates you and inspires you to like stick with, you know, your word, do what you say you're going to do, and you'll be proud of yourself in the end. It's like working out, which I ain't there yet. Don't help me. <laughs> I know I need to work out. I did get some healthy things. I went to the store again. Um, I got some fruit, um, which when I'm on a diet, I do stay away from fruit. I mentioned that in my um, weight loss journey video. I know a lot of people don't agree with that but I got blackberries nothing too sweet but you know you need something um sometimes and what else did I get oh, I'm gonna make myself a little I think I made it on the thing before on the channel like a little quiche casserole for breakfast and you know I can eat on that no carbs at all um also air fryer I got my chicken so I'm gonna try to do better up until my trip I'm gonna try to have I'm gonna try to eat nothing but meat that like no carbs except drinks because y'all know i love a libation 
Um, but yeah, I'm going to try to do no carbs because the, my eating has been out of control. I know for a fact, like I don't look, I'm not an advocate for my arm is getting tired. <laughs> I'm not an advocate for drinking empty carbs. Like they, they help you none. Okay. They serve no purpose. And I've mentioned that when I was very strict, I did not only have water, okay, and zero calorie drinks. However, comma, when you are drinking crazy and eating crazy, eliminating a thing or two will help you. So right now, I'm eating crazy and drinking crazy. So I'm going to try to eliminate the eating crazy and see. But yeah, anyway, I'm procrastinating. Let me get to this, y'all. I'll talk to y'all tomorrow. Thank you for tuning in to Tuesday. <laughs> or I may show y'all my rack when I get done. We'll see, child. We'll see. Talk to y'all later. Hey, y'all. So I'm ready to film. I've already gotten, you know, my rack together. So I'm ready to get this video done. Um, I had a little lemonade, you know, just preparing myself. <laughs> Cleaned up the living room. And yeah, so we're going to go ahead and get started. I'll show you guys my rack really, really quickly. Um, let me do that real quick. Okay, y'all, so here is my rack so far. Um, it doesn't look that exciting because <laughs> I don't have all of the things just yet, but this is the rack and I'll be talking about some spring trends. So, stay tuned for that video. Actually, looking at that, that reminded me I needed to hang up another piece or two, actually. Um, so I'm gonna put two more pieces up here and then go ahead and get started. <laughs> but anyway, um, after this, y'all, I'm going to bed. It's late, I'm not gonna even tell you what time it is, but trust me, it's late. So after this, I'll be going to bed. So I will see you guys tomorrow, hopefully. <laughs> Bye, y'all. Good morning, y'all. Today is Thursday, happy Thursday. Um, I did not, oh no, I'm probably dried up. My lash glue. Um, I did not film yesterday, y'all. I was trying to get my house in order. You know how it goes. So, <laughs> yesterday, um, Trump put a ban on traveling from Europe, I believe. I'm not sure that I understand the full thing. But I know everybody's asking me about the trip to Paris. And honestly, I just don't know. Because some people are saying that the ban does not apply to American citizens. It's only to foreigners. So I don't know. That's weird if it is. Um, and there's so many things that can develop within the time that I'm leaving. Because I'm leaving in April. Um, but it is within that time frame. So who knows? I don't know if we're going. I don't know if we're not. I don't know if we're going to just opt out and not go even if the trip isn't canceled either. So trying to figure everything out. Um but we'll see. Um, I'm not a scary person. <laughs> like, I haven't been nervous about this. So, it's not that. But what I will say is, like, I mean, obviously, people have died from it. Um, yes, the fatality rate is very low and all of that. And, you know, they saying that it's more of the elderly people who are heavily impacted by it. And, I guess, children or something like that. Or they're, the children are the carriers. But my thing is, if they have banned flights, like I'm not arguing with that man. You know what I'm saying? If they ban the flights, I'm not arguing with that man because the thing is, the flight is really the problem. You're in such close quarters with people, um, you know, and the air is very thin. So that's really the issue. So I'm not sure what's going on. Um Obviously, I'd love to go to Paris, but if I'm not going to be able to enjoy myself while I'm there, there will literally be no point, you know? So, we'll see. What's going on? I hate this. So, yeah, y'all. Um, I just wanted to pop in really quickly and let y'all know the Paris trip may be canceled after all that I done talked about. So maybe I just shouldn't have even said nothing about it, huh? <laughs> no, nah, but I was excited. So, um, but yeah, we'll see if we have to postpone it, just not go or what, because I'm telling you, a lot of things are happening in such a short amount of time. Like, it's kind of crazy. And Tom Hanks and his wife just announced that they tested positive. Um, I forget the NBA Utah Jazz player or something, Gobert. He tested positive. And so, 
honestly, before I had never, I didn't know the people who had it, you know, not that I know them personally, but I didn't know the ages or anything like that. And so now that there is a case that um, I guess is kind of known now because these are celebrities, um, maybe we'll actually see how it progresses. But what got me was um, Tom Hanks. He said that they're in Australia right now. And he said it felt like they had like a little mild cold, but his wife, um, and, and they both felt tired. But that should not be one of the side effects, which of course, when you have a cold, you do feel fatigued. But they said that the whole fatigue thing was the sign of the flu, not the corona. If you see those lists that everybody's like posting. So I was like, so basically it feel like the flu. And then his wife also got like chills that came and went. So it wasn't just this whole coughing, sneezing, and what was the other one? Uh, shortness of breath. So you really just don't know. It's, it's literally the fear of the unknown. Like it's something that we've never really seen as far as this strand is concerned. But it, it makes you think like what happened with Ebola? What happened with swine flu and all that? Um, cause I think Kim Kardashian had the swine flu. <laughs> it's not funny. She had the, the swine flu. So yeah, I mean, things are just developing, you know, day by day. So we'll see what happens, but regardless, you know, it's better to be safe than sorry, literally. So anyway, I'm going to go ahead and rush and get this foundation and this face done. And I'll talk to y'all a little bit later. Hey y'all, so really quickly, I'm gonna show y'all my outfit is super simple. Um, I'm just wearing some studs today and I'm wearing this old top. It's like a Swiss dot top. I have it tied up in the front. This is from Zara, but I need to replace this because it's looking a little dingy actually. <laughs> so I need to replace this. And then I have on just some black jeans. These are top shop jeans. And then I just have on my Balenciaga mules and I'm carrying my reissue. Um, I have some things I need to send back, to, well take back to Nordstrom today if I make it. And then I have some uh, packages to mail off um, to the people who bought stuff from the sale. So I will talk to you guys later. It's so crazy. First of all, let's just throw 2020 away. Um, I just left Nordstrom because I'm off work and we have another tornado warning. So they told us to leave. <laughs> um, but right now um, I'm about to go get me some lunch because I haven't eaten. And then I still need to go and drop off some packages. I just made a return. Oh, my hair look white. See, mm -mm, these wigs. But yeah, so that's what we're doing. May just get something here around at the mall. Uh, my boyfriend is off again for the rest of the week. Uh, well, it's only Thursday, so Friday. I don't know if they're off Monday, but maybe we'll just do like Cheesecake Factory or something. So yeah, just wanted to update you guys. I'm sick of 2020 with the Roni, honey, and with this trip, which I'm not mad about the trip to be honest, because it can always be postponed or whatever, but it's just like, it's too much going on. It's too much going on. Hey y'all, so I'm back home. How often do y'all see me sitting on this couch? Like never. Um, it's been hectic. I, I keep forgetting to vlog, child. There's so much going on today. So I left work early, as y'all saw. We went to a Cheesecake Factory for a little while. Oh, it's just been high stress, okay? But now I'm back home, and I was told that we don't need to come into work tomorrow. So glad I brought my computer home. <laughs> it's not funny. It's just like, it's just so much. Like, 2020 is just like, it's trash, for real, for real. I'm tired, y'all. Like, I don't know if it's my mental. Okay, the, I don't, who are you? Okay, I don't know if it's just my mental that's exhausted or I'm really sleepy. 
Ooh, child, but excuse me. I don't know. I just need to. I need a nap and a do over for today. Oh, I ordered the um, you know that water. Well, what skirt is y'all know that blue satin skirt that I tried on at Zara? I ordered that in a large because the extra large was too big. And of course, I'm just giving all the hips in the world in that. So I just hate that it's like, I don't understand how, like the other one was so big and then this one is just like, so it's like I'm living the tailored life now, which is, I mean, it's good, I guess, because you can make sure everything fits you properly. But I need to just lose some weight. Like, and I'm honestly, I'm just lazy and I don't feel like it right now. Like, I'm just the hungriest I've ever been. <laughs> and I really don't feel like working out right now. Like, that's just the reality of it. I'm not, I don't make excuses, okay? I always tell y'all, don't make excuses for weight loss because that's not how the weight comes off. You have to just do it. There's no secret. And I just don't feel like it. Like... How real can that, can you get? Um, but yeah, that's that on that. And I was going to buy a bag because I think the Paris trip is pretty much postponed. Um, but you know what I realized? I have bought so much stuff, which I still have to do my luxury haul for you guys. But I've bought so much stuff. Like, I really don't need anything else. Obviously, I don't need anything not like I don't need, I don't need anything else. But I did want like, you know, the classic Chanel, which that time will come for me. Um, or like the Chanel trendy, I think. I think I'm actually leaning towards that one more if we go. I don't know, child. But anyway, the point of it is this morning I woke up and was like, you know what? I'm going to buy more stock because I have stocks, but I'm about, I bought some more because it's just like, I have, you know, the money to do it. And right now, stocks are low. So this is the time. Now, you know, with love, please don't ask me <laughs> what you should invest in. None of those things because I can't tell you that. Like, I do not feel comfortable talking about finance or giving financial advice. I'll say that. I can talk about mine, you know, at my comfort level. But to give somebody else financial advice... I can't do it. It's just very uncomfortable to me. And I just don't like to be responsible, period. Um, that's just my nature. That's anything. Like even we're giving advice to uh, friends and stuff, not even about money, but just like about life. Like only if you ask me because I don't want to be responsible. But um, and I'm timid with that. But um, needless to say, yeah, I went ahead and invested a little bit more. There's a lot I want to do. Um, I just need to do a little bit more research on it. But yeah, that was just a start today. So if that can encourage some of y'all, you know, this is a good time to kind of dip and dabble into stocks a little bit. Cash App, if you like really want to just test it out, Cash App has stocks on there um, that you can buy and they tell you the rate and everything. And yeah, they have this decent, it's easy, you know, to navigate. So that's a good one. Robin Hood, of course, um, is a good one as well. But yeah, that's all on that. Um, so I'm not going to work tomorrow. I need to get my car, uh, I need to get some new brakes on my car. I had been holding off because I want a new car, but I'm like, you know what? I just don't know. I don't know. I'm in a frugal mood right now, <laughs> but yeah, I'm getting my brakes fixed for sure. The thing about it is, is like when I bought my car, <laughs> When I bought my car, my car was like a year old, I think, when I bought it. Like, not too old or whatever. But when I bought it, that's when the maintenance was due. And so I saw what the other person did. I was like, I'm going to do the same thing now. But it's because I, I get it. Like, it's expensive to, like, keep up, you know, foreign cars and stuff like that. So it's like when it gets to that point to where you're already ready to get a new car. And then it's time to do that big maintenance because I have a few things. Uh, you just be like, let me just trade that in. But my car is paid for, so <laughs> I'm going to keep it, you know. But anyway, y'all, I'm running off on a tangent. I'm tired. So I'm probably going to go take a nap or something. 
everybody has been telling me to watch Love is Blind. I watched like 10 minutes of the first episode. It seemed all right, but of course we already know how it ends. So, <laughs> But um, yeah, I don't know if I'll watch that. All American, I need to catch up on that. So maybe I'll do that and just rest. So nothing too exciting today, you guys, at all. <laughs> could film a video but I'm honestly just way too exhausted to do that so it's probably not gonna happen it will be smart but it's not gonna happen so and oh my goodness so I have a facial Saturday I wonder will she cancel due to this corona girl everybody's getting a roni okay I'm just like ooh. which she always wears a mask I don't but is that safe Cause she just got over a cold not too long ago child i don't know no more it's just a mess look at this bump i need something done though face been breaking out <sighs> but anyway let me not talk y'all's head off okay so i will talk to you guys probably tomorrow because i doubt i'll do anything tonight since we're under another tornado warning it's not a watch or is it the bed yeah warning no it's a watch i don't know child one of them is not that serious one of them is take cover ours is it may happen but don't take cover yet so that's what it is i can't remember but anyway y'all i'll talk to y'all later Good morning you guys <laughs> i know i look crazy but happy friday guess what i'm at home because we are working from home indefinitely it's gotten a bit it's gotten a bit crazy so yeah getting my coffee um i have a meeting in a minute so i need to get this coffee hold on look at this why Do, am i the only one that the scarf just comes off at night like it's ridiculous but um oh hey but yeah y'all we are working from home indefinitely until they tell us to come back in and let me just tell you, that's serious because we work in healthcare. So, well, corporate, you know, but still, for them to do that, something's going on that they're not telling us. Um, that just gives me, I was going to call my cleaning lady because I was starting to get a little bit of overwhelmed with all this stuff. But it's really not too, it's not like crap in the house, it's clothes. And when you start to get like a lot of free clothes then you buy some clothes it's like okay get rid so i'm gonna take this time to really um that's three i'm gonna take this time to really try to clean this house i know i keep saying it but it is what it is then also my refrigerator isn't getting like cold like normal but the freezer is working fine so i tried to turn it turn the knob a little bit to make it a little colder. I don't know what's going on. So I may have to get a new refrigerator, which I mean, I, this refrigerator came with the place and I was gonna get like new appliances and stuff. And then I was like, but I kind of like the all white because I made, you know, I kind of like decorated around it and the kitchen's white, but I don't know. I guess I may have to get a new fridge, but if I get a new fridge, that means I got to get a new stove, got to get a new dishwasher. What's going on? Um, all the new things because everything, all the appliances are white. And I had a um, fridge actually that I got before I even moved in here, but it didn't fit in the space. It was too big. So I need to measure that space to see what type of fridge I can get because I don't think I could even get like a cool refrigerator like what I bought. So annoying. But anyway, um, I'm actually working from home today and I'm going to, what am I going to do? I don't know. I may do a live today, but maybe not everybody's off work. So who knows, child? But yeah, I just had to come by and tell y'all that I'm going to have to be self-motivated to actually put makeup on because when I'm at home, I do not wear makeup. So that's why I never film on Wednesdays. But now that... I'm gonna be working from home like indefinitely to keep with my schedule. I'm gonna to have to like get up and put makeup on. Oh, I don't like it. I don't like it, but it is what it is. So gotta be safe. 
um, postponing the trip. I think I already mentioned that. And yeah, that's what's going on for today. Let me hurry up and go jump on this call real quick. And I'll check back in with y'all later. Y'all, hey so I am off work. Let me turn these lights off. Y'all, I'm off work. I'm gonna go by my parents' house. I'm gonna see if they wanna go look at um some appliances <laughs> because that would be helpful. And yeah, that's about it. So I done changed clothes like three times today. Y'all see, I still got my rack back there, but I have gotten some more clothes together. You see them all the way over there to go to the Goodwill. And yeah, so that's what I've done. Just kind of gotten some clothes out, ready to get out of my house because I got too much stuff. I'm also thinking about um, doing a, another closet system in my second bedroom. That's where I use, like, that's my office kind of makeshift office but I really need to utilize that space to put more shelving and stuff in there because I just need more space for like clothes and stuff and shoes specifically I don't really have a good system for shoes so and handbags so yeah that's the plan but right now I'm just gonna go to my parents house see what they're doing I'm kind of bored so <laughs> yeah we'll see what happens so we're looking at fridges I need a new fridge Oh, Rhoda. Okay. So my, I'm going to drop my phone and take a picture. Because the animal. That's why you should have brought his leash. Okay. Yeah, the fridge done went out. I need to go back up there and show them. Even then, according to y'all, uh, this is, what we say, 20, 20, 20. eight. Oh, it's, uh -huh. right? 28? No, we said it was, because uh, the other one was 30. This is like 20. This is this will work. This will work. What is that one? 29. I think that else will fit in that area. Unless maybe we was off on the inch. Jeez, all these are standard. The 29 is the standard. The 29. Okay. Well, maybe the phone was off. Yeah, the phone was 29. <laughs> <laughs> no, sir. And that's not a dog, that's a family member. Right? <laughs> I don't, I don't. We got one of them at the house. Yeah, he's, he's a Brody. His, his last name mm, is Cole. He's got the same oh. initials as me. Say hi, Brody. Hi. <laughs> we picked up a, our son. Picked up he's a good a, doggy. Uh, boxer. Mm -hmm. Daddy, he I is. never he's knew heavy. that boxers were <laughs> oh, yeah, I know he does. He loves people. Yeah. How old is he? Uh, seven. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, the boy. No, is he seven years old already? Mm -hmm. 2012, yep. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, so we done found a couple. They didn't have a lot of options, but we'll see. I may be moving, so who even knows? <laughs> but we'll see what I'm gonna do. <sighs> Unexpected purchases, but you have to adult. I done ate. My mama done cooked up everything in their fridge. I'm telling you, they done bought up everything. We got turkey legs, we got baked chicken, we got air fried chicken. <laughs> and now I'm about to watch Beyonce Coachella. So, living my best life. No. <laughs> we are chilling, they in there watching I See White People. What is it? Mama, what's that movie called? White People what? Dear white people, my attention span is not great for movies, but I'm gonna watch Coachella. <laughs> I need my dad to make me a margarita because he makes the best margaritas ever. But he's been ripping and running all day, so I'm trying to find the right time to like slide in there. Oh, yeah, and the wig is done. Like, you see, it's flipping up. That's why I got this thing on my head. <laughs> Happy Saturday. I'm about to go and get a facial. Look at all these clothes I gotta wash. Um, I'm about to go get a facial. It's been a while, you guys. So I'm super excited. I haven't gotten a facial 
in maybe a couple of months. So that's what we're heading to do today. Um, I actually did like a little Q&A type thing. Well, we're going to do a Q&A, but I've asked you guys on Instagram to send in your questions. You did this a while ago, but obviously the appointments were getting canceled due to like me being sick or sh she was sick. You know, and then this is the time that we can do it. So <laughs> we're going to be answering those questions today on IG Live. So that should be fun. And then I may do a little cheeky purchase, not a little one. But mm, if you follow me on Instagram, you saw that y'all were telling me to get this bag. And I was like, no, I'm not buying anything. You know, we're going to Paris in less than 30 days. Well, obviously that is not happening. So um, the essay, the bag actually had sold out that same day. And then he called me yesterday and was like, hey, I have another one. I'll hold it for you until tomorrow so you can come and take a look at it because I don't know how it would sit on me. So I'll probably go um, look at it today and see. But I really don't want to make that kind of purchase today, but I know it will be a collector's item. So I can always sell it for like way more. But yeah, we'll see. So um, I'll talk to y'all when I get to Serenity Studios. Guys, I am at the spa but the spa <laughs> serenity studios i just got my facial and jasmine hooked me up i had to do some extractions this time y'all it was crazy right here right here that was my first time getting some extractions but we posted everything on ig story so hopefully you're checking that out <laughs> i'll probably add it to my skincare highlight as well so that it can you know stay on but yeah i just got a um text from the chanel guy saying that they're having 10 percent off so we'll definitely be going by there to see what they have and see what's going on because i'm like is this 10 percent off because of the roni or just because or what because that's just weird um and then of course y'all know me and jasmine we always want to go get something to eat and a libation <laughs> we always want to get something to eat so we're probably going to go to hampton social there's jasmine over there she's hey, cleaning up She's doing all the Trying deep. Trying to get rid of this wrong. Right. Girl, the <laughs> deep in, in uh, what is it, disinfecting. Got to clean up everything. But, yep, so we're about to go and have a little bit of fun on this dreary Saturday. Do you notice that every time I come here, it's raining? It is. Every single time it rains. So, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, skin is glowing per usual. I always have super glowing skin when I leave here. And I have a mint in my mouth, so just in case y'all was See the inside. That one is really fun. Love it. I'm back for the lobster roll. It was so good. I think, I don't know if Jasmine's gonna try it, but she likes seafood, but she's picky. So we'll see. Because I don't want her to take my recommendation and don't like it. But everything is good here. I told y'all the last time. I was here last Sunday, so. I'm back again. 
Patty's Day Frosé. <laughs> so it's green, but it was cheaper, so that's what we got, of course. <laughs> uh, so Jasmine picked up these Brussels sprouts, and they are really good. I love the goat cheese, actually, and I didn't think I would care for that. Now the nuts, I can do without, but right. <laughs> they could have kept the nuts. <laughs> they could have kept the nuts. <laughs> And we're drinking our St. Patty's Day drinks. <laughs> do you like it? The same I thing. do. You do? Mm -hmm. Okay, so I am back home. And, oh my goodness. It's been a long day. It's kind of raining. Um, uh-uh, is this already old? Yo, I just bought these blueberries, y'all, and look, that's mold. Now I gotta throw the whole thing in the trash. I am disgusted. Are you kidding me? Meanies, ew. Rent. These are trash. I gotta take this out because I don't want these sitting in my trash can. Anyway, I guess I'm not gonna eat those. But yeah, so we went by Nordstrom. I don't know if I vlogged in there. Um, it was hectic, okay? They had 10% off today, you guys. And this never happens. It included like Chanel bags and everything. So um, I bought a little something because I just couldn't pass it up and my trip was postponed. So I'm like, mm -hmm. I think I should get something, but I'm not going to say I'm going to go on a shopping ban, but I'm really going to try my best and like focus on other things um, and not buy anything for a little while because I have everything I want, just to be honest. Of course, there's always something new and then, you know, you get distracted by shiny things, but it's like, eh, I don't need anything. So yeah, I bought a little something. Let's see. I'm not gonna show you guys just yet, but there it is. <laughs> so um, hopefully I'll do like a YouTube video on that or something soon. Um, I'm about to hang up these clothes and drink some wine and probably watch a little movie or something because I was gonna have some blueberry, I mean blackberries, but that's not an option anymore. So yeah, anyway, let me go ahead and end off the vlog now. Um, I'll probably start. It's going to be very interesting now that I'm not like going into work. That's like my motivation to get up and get started with the day. But yeah, not doing that. So it's going to be interesting to see how the vlog goes over the next few weeks while we're quarantined. So yeah, y'all. Thank you so much for tuning into this week's vlog. I will see you guys next week. Bye, y'all. And everybody stay safe out there for real because I know it's like a lot of, you know, jokes going around about this stuff, but when the nation starts to shut down, we may need to take it a little bit serious. So yeah, just be safe out there, you guys. It's a lot going on right now. Natural disasters, you know, everything's happening all at once. Maybe God's trying to tell us something. So anyway, I'll see you guys next week. Bye y'all.